Yo, what's up, guys? It is Turtle Gift. Um, welcome to another tips and trick in Colorism Mobile. All right, first start that. Please don't forget to like this video and also hit the sub button down below for more videos. All right, on this video, I'll show you guys how to, you know, how to change your link, call mobile email address to a new email address in a way. Okay, actually, I did this actually on my, you know, on my text account and you work out successfully. So actually, this is like, this will be like the second time right now. I'll be doing this right now because I have so many test accounts in Call Mobile. If you guys don't know, yeah, actually, I always create Call Mobile accounts every time I need to test some things because I don't want to risk my account to any perspective. So before I do anything, I have to, you know, run a test server to try to do it. So right now, this is very well right now. This account is a level six account. So it just started up and I don't have any clan. I got nothing in this account. So actually, this was the account that I made on how to, you know, create a, create a guest account and also how to link a guest account to Facebook and also to, you know, to come by account. All right, guys. So in this video, I want to show you guys how to change the email address that was being linked in your college mobile account. Okay, so first of all, before you can do this, guys, you need to, you know, ball into Chrome browser. Okay, so let's just, you know, minimize again and let's go to Chrome browser. Yeah. Okay, so right now we're gonna start. So actually, sorry, my phone is kind of broken. You know, I have a broken screen, so I'm so difficult to, you know, search for a reward. Okay, what I'm searching for right now is Call of Duty Mobile. Okay, just if you can see the link already on my phone already, so I've been there like a whole day trying to change my profile pics and see if you can actually, you know, change it again and it's not possible. <laughs> okay, so right now we're going to go ahead and log in our account. So click on this three icon over here, top right corner over there, click on it, you're going to see login your account, click on login account. Okay, wait for it. So right now you're gonna put the same account you have been linked to the game. So like you know the same email address, still put the same thing. So just go ahead and you know put in your email address. So I'm gonna put this email address. Oh my gosh. Okay. Sorry, I need to blow that place because of my email address because I don't want my account to be hacked even though it's, even though it's, a, it's a test account, I still don't want to be hacked. Alright, so right now I've been logged in. So all I have to do is, you know, go to your profile, I click on the profile and wait for it to load up. Okay, so once it's already loaded up in your profile, then just scroll down. Okay, you're going to see this basic info. Yeah, just go ahead and click on the basic info. Okay, guys, I'm gonna blow this screen a little bit. So, right now, I'm on a basic info. So, you know, on your basic info, you're gonna see your email address, you know, you're gonna see your full name, email address, password, address, um, achieve ID number. Well, that's free to stop. Just go ahead and click on the you know, edit email address, click on it. Okay, right now, it's gonna ask you to you know, put in your email address. So, just Go ahead and change the email address to the new email address which you actually have so if you don't have an email address yeah i guess you need to create an email address and make sure the email address email address are creating must be an active email address that you actually know the password okay why this is gonna help you is if you actually use your bro account or your mom's account or anybody account to create a create the call mobile account you can actually go ahead and you know let me say unlink it and link it to a new account so i'll be trying to do this on facebook and it's not working but right now it's working for call mobile okay once i'm done you know putting in the email address just on the save okay right now you're gonna put the password again you are used i mean used to log in to be sure that you are the one trying to change your account or not just go ahead and you know pulling the password again 
Okay, sorry right now I'm trying to put my password and my phone is gonna misbehaving. Okay, so I think don't press on me. Okay, just wait some minute, wait some minute. Alright, so it's been changed right now. I would love to show you guys what my email address is, but I can't just show you guys my email address. I'm very sorry, but right now I've changed my email address like a couple of two times right now. Okay, so once you're done, you know, trying to log in, so let's just go ahead and, you know, close the browser and go back to Colors Mobile again and, you know, reopen the game again. Just go to Colors Mobile. Okay, right now we are going to log out this account. Yeah, let's log it out. Okay, so right now when I'm trying to log in with the Colmo by address and let's see when I try to use the old email address first of all and let's see what happened when we we'll try to use the email address, the old email address. Yeah, so um, yeah, let's go ahead and click on Call of Duty and wait a minute. Okay, so click over here. Let's put in the old email address. Okay, let's try to log in. Okay, right now, that's what it's saying right now. It's saying you have entered an invalid email address. Even though the password is correct, even though everything is correct, since it's an old email address, it's still going to be showing the same thing. So let's just go ahead and, you know, put in your one. And let's try to log in again. Okay, boom. We have been logging automatically straight to it. And guys, and here, one more thing, guys. So once you're done, you know, changing your active account, you should just go ahead to your email address to you know gmail.com and try to synchronize it again straight to you're gonna be safe so you can't gonna be saved automatically on your phone or you know your ID is gonna be saved in the way so right now I'm back to my old you know to my new active account so I just did this stuff twice right now so first of all I change it to the first one and see if it's possible and yes if it's possible and I try to again to the old one again and it's still possible so I can do this millions of times if I like and I can still keep doing it if I actually want to anyway <laughs> alright guys so that guys that's for the video guys don't forget to like this video and also guys please hit the sub button down below for more videos and if you are new guys thank you guys so much for your support and I'll see you guys for another video this is a church gift and have a good day guys and take care of yourself oh yeah yo what's up guys check out this app that's trending it's called status and media downloader download all media with one click okay guys so you can download any any videos or pictures from any social media from likey instagram whatsapp tiktok facebook and twitter all in one click all you have to do is download the app and you know download whatever you want to download by copying the link and go over here and you know just go ahead and paste the link so right now guys you can download any videos or any pictures you want from any factors okay guys wanna get this app wanna get this app twitch can kind of jump below for the link that jump below and get the app and guys get this app it's gonna be cool because you can download any videos or anything you want from any status or any media downloader and that's it guys once you download the app then you're gonna go ahead and see everything downloaded right now so guys that's it for the video guys don't forget to go ahead and check out this app it's called status and media downloader download everything you want in just one click all right guys